Hey everybody, this is Buddy. You ain't gonna believe where I'm at. I'm at the place that's um, got the forms for this huge house that's being built in the Ozarks. And these are the forms. You can see how it looks. Transform is the name of the company. And these are walls. And you can see the concrete would go in here. It shows you what the plumbing looks like. And there's the other wall. Look how thick that is. Yep, they're right here in uh, Ozark, Missouri. Right where uh, I can watch this house being built out of concrete. And this is the form work. So I thought I'd share that with you. Hey everybody, this is Buddy. You ain't gonna believe where I'm at. I'm at a place where they're using the TF system. It's going up right now. We're gonna be talking about the TF system in videos. So this is like uh, my first experience with it to watch it go up. This is the transform system. Yeah, this is a project we're working with, uh, the new uh, transform system from TF Forming Systems. Hey everybody, this is the back side of the wall. Right now you can see it's kicked off and it actually be where you can stand on that as scaffolding. That's a part of the system that comes with the package. This is one of the most innovative systems for ICF on the market today. The TF system revolutionized the ICF industry with the introduction in 1994 of its vertically oriented design. Developed by construction professionals, the TF system's vertical design was created specifically as a solution to the problems common in horizontal designs. Problems such as dimensional instability. During the concrete pour and consolidation, the filling of the wall cavity can cause the segments of a horizontal ICF to actually lift and separate from one another. Due to the design of horizontal systems, the floating effect of the concrete is transferred directly to the forms. This can dramatically affect the final height and straightness of the walls. Ironically, the concrete pour can have just the opposite effect. In some cases, the rigidly attached cross members may instead transfer the weight of the concrete directly to the foam segments, causing them to compress, even to the point that walls are shorter than expected. Unfortunately, this settling effect is not uniformly predictable and varies greatly within a project, making it impossible to adjust for it. Because the vertical I-beams of the TF system are not rigidly attached to the polystyrene planks, the floating or settling effect of the concrete is never transferred to the planks themselves. Your walls end up just as the drawings called for them, every time. Also, since our I-beams are a continuous rigid member from the top of the wall to the footing, as opposed to the multiple segments of horizontal systems, you can be certain that your walls will go up straight and stay straight. While you're pouring your TF system walls, horizontal ICF builders will still be attaching vertical bracing to straighten their walls. The TF system's vertical design closely resembles that of wood or metal frame construction. This means that any crew familiar with conventional construction methods will feel right at home, right from the start, with the TF system. Crews accustomed to working with conventional concrete forms will find the TF system offers many similarities in setup. But be careful, one job with the TF system and they won't want to go back to conventional forms again. The strength and durability of concrete. A construction system based upon simplicity and versatility. Unparalleled customer support from start to finish. And the long-term economy of quality ICF construction. That's the TF system. Isn't it time for you to take a closer look? You've got a lot more questions than we could possibly answer here, so we invite you to give us a call. Whether you're considering a home or commercial building project, whether you're a small or large contractor, whether you're considering ICFs for below grade construction or the entire structure, you owe it to yourself to check out the TF Vertical Building System. In the world of ICFs, 
Somebody's finally got it right.